Hi, my name is Taylor Acton, and I am a current first year uh, resident here at Baylor Scott and White in Temple, and I'm here to give you a tour of the hospital. So come on. This is the elevator. After a quick elevator ride, we're on the seventh floor of the hospital. This is where a lot of the teaching teams are for internal medicine wards. A and B team are both here, and you'll mainly see patients on this floor, but there are eight floors total in this uh, building of the hospital. So let's go check out a team room. We're going to the B team room right now. There's quite a few beds in this hospital. Uh, on, the, on this floor, the rooms are uh, single beds. Um, on either side of the elevator, there are nursing stations surrounded by the uh, rooms, patient rooms. This is the B team room where we get a lot of our work done. This is a typical team room. As you can see right here, we have Dr. Robinson and Dr. Young getting some work done. This is a pretty typical example of a team room. Uh, per team, there's usually an upper level resident accompanied by two interns. Uh, and this is a pretty good example of what these rooms look like, some computers and workspaces. Now we're going to head down to 4 South to look at the D team room. We come to the D team room. So this is another team room. As you can see, there's more computers as well as Dr. Fan giving a lesson. Hello. Hey. Now let's go down to the second floor, which is where our ICU is. This is an example of a typical ICU room. Here in the ICU, we have the medical ICU, uh, cardiovascular ICU, neuro ICU, as well as a surgical trauma ICU for a total of around 70 beds. Uh, from here, we can check out the ICU team room. And here's the workroom for the ICU. Similar to our uh, workrooms on seventh floor, we have a lot of computers where residents can chart review and get our work done. Hey guys. Hey. Now we're at the Texas A&M Health Science Center College of Medicine here at Baylor Scott and White, uh, where we do a lot of our didactic sessions as well as uh, conferences. So let's check it out. This is an example of a lecture hall where we have our didactic sessions. <laughs> this is Mayborn Auditorium where we have a larger group setting available. Let's head up to the second floor where our medical library is, where you can find residents typically studying. Here's the medical library. Let's check it out.
Down here in the basement of our hospital is what we refer to as the Hall of Mustaches, where it's lined with our medical forefathers. I hope to grow one out like that one day. This is our cafeteria. There's fresh choices here every day, in addition to a subway at the end of the hall. This is the Busy Bean, serving Starbucks to residents who need to fill up on some pumpkin spice lattes before rounds. And this is our resident lounge, where you can typically find residents relaxing or working hard. And then over here is our chief lounge, where you can see our chiefs are hard at work. Alrighty, and this is the medical staff lounge. Come through here, you can see there's a nice big table to work at, as well as computers. You can typically find residents or doctors stocking up on coffee or some snacks during the day. And maybe one of the best parts about this room is this view. Man, check that out. I'm Bryce Roadhouse. I'm one of the first year cardiology fellows. Uh, I'm also a recent graduate from the internal medicine program here at Baylor Scott & White in Temple. Um, had a great experience uh, here in the internal medicine program and uh, felt like it prepared me really well for cardiology fellowship, which I'm uh, doing now and having a lot of fun. Um, so this is our uh, cath labs. Um, we have three cath labs here. Um, one of them is being um, remodeled. Um, we can come in here and we can show you the, our cath lab one that's uh, up and running. Um, here we do thousands of casts per year. Um, we have a full, full spectrum of interventional cardiology that we do. Um, we're a high TAVR volume hospital. Um, in addition to that, we, uh, we do lots of other advanced procedures, mitral clips, uh, watchmans. Um, we have access to, you know, IVUS and um, OCT for those that are interested in that. Um, so a lot of really great and impressive things going on here in the, in the interventional cardiology department. Thank you for joining us here at Baylor Scott & White in Temple. We look forward to hopefully seeing you next year.